Hey, this is Tommy Clefettis coming to you from Birmingham, England, the home of Black Sabbath, who I'm playing for tonight. And you're watching Rhythm Magazine's video extravaganza. My core is a rack and two floors and a kick. Yes. And that's really the basic setup. So, it, um, I mean, I could do the gig on that, but I use the second kick. I use all the little toms. There's a couple little extra, of course, because it looks fucking cool, I think. Um, but yeah, why not? There's a certain sound that you get with two kicks that's so much fuller than a double pedal. And it, it, you can't make those two kicks sound exactly the same. And I think that's cool. I think once you get used to that second pedal, it's um, way hipper than playing a double pedal. But to each their own. I mean, I get it, you get used to that double pedal, but I think there's much more power and, and, and cool um, coolness that comes out of the two kicks versus playing a double pedal on one kick. It's, I look at it as an opportunity for myself to play great music and experience something new. If I wasn't going to play drums, somebody else would have played drums. So if somebody asked me to play drums and it's somewhere where I can grow and have a great experience, of course I'm going to do it. I, you know, you go, would I regret not doing this? Yes. So you have to do it. How could you not? Yeah, and I understand all the mixed feelings and emotions and all that kind of stuff from fans or, or critics or whatever, and I totally get it. Um, but I'm here to do the greatest job that I can and give the people in the crowd the experience of hearing those songs. And I think I've done that, and I think people have walked away when they come to the shows enjoying what I've brought to, you know, from myself hopefully bringing that, that Sabbath feeling for those people, if that makes sense. Paying homage to what was done before me, and I'm just trying to have a good time and make people have a good time, so. This way of playing is, it's a lost art. It's, it's done, so, I mean, these are the absolute best musicians I've ever played for. They're, whether they're warming up, I can hear a geezer warming up in the other dressing room, you go, oh my God, his tone, how he bends his notes, the soul. He's like Paul McCartney of heavy metal, James Jamerson of heavy metal. And Tony and the musicality and the heaviness and the combination, you know, it, it's really made me a better musician and that is the coolest thing for me. Really, I feel, pushed me and made me a better drummer and think differently. So, and that's what it's all about. One is not better or valid than the other. The one that is more valid is the person who has more heart and more want. It, I don't care, you can, if you have more want to do something, you will succeed over the guy who's more, maybe has innate ability. I believe that. Because I don't think I'm the best drummer in the world, but I do know I work hard, and I keep going, and I keep going, and I keep going, and I don't fucking stop.